My PPX supports remote registration, so users can register remote extensions to my PPX from other places to realize remote working. Let's see how to register a remote extension. First of all, open the SIP registration port and RTP communications port of my PPX to public network through port forwarding on the router. The default SIP port is UDP 5060 and the RTP port is UDP 10000 to 12000. These values can be queried and changed in SIP settings page. If my PBX is not behind the router of the company's internal network, instead it is on the public network then there's no need to set up port forwarding. After port forwarding, go back to SIP settings page and configure net settings. Fill the external IP address. and local network identification. And net mode is yes. Refer to part 2 net settings if you want to configure net in other ways. Save the settings. Next, set up the remote extension. You can edit the existing extension or create a new one. In the Extension Edit page, under Optional Settings, check the box Net and Remotely Register. Only the MyPBX with the subversion number higher than 70 has the Remotely Register option. There is no need to configure this option in lower firmware versions. At last, register the remote extension. It is similar to registering an extension in the internal network. The only difference is that the SIP server is the external IP or domain name of my PBX instead of its internal IP. The rest of the settings are the same.